everyone it's silicon reborn love life i'm finally in the house got baby faith with us i have the camera a little low because i'm in the midst of eating um and like i told you guys in the first video in her and rogues box opening that it was in the car we've been in the car all day because i couldn't afford to miss you know getting her you know i told y'all previously my post delivery people are just really weird when it comes to delivering stuff and you are not standing outside because I live in an apartment building and they refuse to leave my boxes regardless if I've signed the signature online. So I was in the car for about five to six hours just waiting on this little one to get here uh, which is Faith's uh, twin sister. She's not the same scope She's not from the same artist. Um, Faith is by Nikita uh, Silicone Babies. She's on eBay and Etsy. Rogue is by Caroline Nelson on Etsy. And I believe she is also on Facebook. I'm, I'm not sure on that. So they're, but their scopes somewhat look similar to me. So that's why I call her Faith's twin sister. So, yes, she is a preemie, like Faith. Faith is a big, big preemie, small newborn. They say she is too, but looking at her, she's a preemie. <laughs> she's a preemie. Well, I'm sorry, y'all, I'm trying to talk and swallow food. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm sorry. <laughs> Trying to eat and do this. But uh, they both have gums. Faith has a top gum, no bottom gums, and a tongue. Rogue has a top gum, bottom gum, and tongue. Um, <clears throat> uh, Faith don't have a soft spot on her head. Rogue has a dip up here has a soft spot on here <clears throat> y'all know faith hands are one hand is balled up closed like a fist the other one she got like two fingers sticking out or whatever um i'm gonna do detailed videos of them showing the differences but yeah but ro got her toes and her fingers are all separated so I wanted to show these two so I'm gonna move their faces so that y'all can because they both have loose necks so I'm gonna turn their heads her neck is a little bit more looser where you can literally kind of don't have to move her body you just move her face with faith you can but it kind of like snaps back her silicone is a little bit more tighter um, but I wanted to let you see I don't know if my lighting is too good in here right now, but I wanted to let you see that, you know, their face expressions are somewhat similar. The only difference is that Faith has a big body compared to Ro. Ro body little, but she got a really birth head. Like her head is shaped in that cone shape when the baby is born. And Faith has more of a little small peanut head, <laughs> little bitty head. So they got their little differences. Faith has a flatter, smaller nose, and Rogue has a more wider nostrils. So it's they got their little differences, like sisters should have. But um, yeah, I'm so happy to have her here. Um, I am finna put Faith in her munchkin swing, so she's not, cause I just did her hair and I want her hair messed up. And you know, she's all comfortable, got her little pass in her mouth. So I'm gonna put her in her munchkin swing, which is behind, well, on the side of the camera. So I'm gonna sit her over there so we can show off her sister and she don't get her hair messy. Okay. I would turn her munchkin swing on for her, but um, I, I really don't wanna mess her hair up right now. So let me get this from behind the camera really quick. Mm. This is 
is over there laying on one of the babies. Okay. So they gotta be a nice little, they gotta be seating blankets. Oh, Miss Unit, before we even move on to the new baby here, I have, am a, I am now officially a grandmommy. Yes, my grandbaby was born, yes, what, two days ago? She is just the cutest little thing. Um, my daughter named her Zainea. I, believe, I hope I'm saying her name right. Uh, I already gave her a name. <laughs> I'm gonna call her Zaza. So uh, she's got some strong little lungs. She's a little tiny thing like this too. She's so little. Just the cutest little thing ever. So yeah. She, her baby came, she's so excited, she is so thrilled. She is the happiest mommy in the world right now. So I'm just so happy for her. I can't wait to meet my grandbaby. But yeah, so, you know, my first time being grandma. I'm really excited, you know, to meet her. But yeah, I wanted to let you all know that she just had her first baby, little girl. So moving on, she she's four pounds too. She is a little tiny thing, <laughs> she little, little. But uh, yes, yeah, so I wanted to tell you all, share that information with you all. But uh, we're, we are going to be moving on to my little snuggles because trust me, when my grandbaby come, I will be putting a video up. So we are going to look at this. This baby is so tiny, you guys. She is so fragile. Like her diapers are like, what is that? A little bit, tiny thing. I am beyond kind of freaked out on how to pick her up because I have had small silicone babies, but this baby is just, she even got like skin peeling and flakes all over her body. Like literally you have to be careful how you pick her up like that. Look how little she is. So I'm just gonna lay her on the blanket. Her hair is unbelievably soft. Like it feels like real freaking baby hair. And I wanted, she asked me if I wanted her to leave the hair long. I'm gonna get closer to you guys because I know it's kind of hard to see. I haven't tested her drinking wet out because I've been on the road with her. Um, let me get a little bit closer to you guys. So you guys can see, put the camera down on her. Get a tad bit more closer. Okay. But yeah, her head really hangs and I don't know if she has a tubing because, no, she doesn't have a tube either. That's funny. That's funny because some silicone artists put tubes in their babies for they drinking wets. But Face don't have one and neither does Rogue. Which um, I just told my fiance, I'm thinking about changing her name to a more of a spiritual name. You know, we have Faith, we have Harmony, uh, we have seasonal names, we have Winter. So, you know, I we picked, I picked Rogue personally off of X-Men. <laughs> so I'm thinking maybe It'd be a good idea if I go with a different name. That's what I was saying. I know that's not my fiance because he is back way too soon. Somebody was walking past my door with the keys. But her eyebrows are rooted. Um, she clearly had armature in her. In her. Not in her legs because they're too folded, but her arms are very, like you can literally lay her and her arms just lay there. Like she got that really floppy, flexible silicone. Like, she's just unbelievably baby-like. Like when you pick her up and like, I wouldn't even pick her up under her arms and I pick Faith up under her arms like, she needs a lot of support. Or right, see her head, and I'm I'm holding her head, but I'm just showing you how far it can drop if you don't hold it or support it. Like her, Faith got a loose head too, you know, loose neck, 
but her head is small, so it's not as heavy. This baby has a heavy head. Like, she got a brain in her head. So you really got to hold the head and hold the bottom of her butt. And her ears are, as you see, her ears are not darker than the rest of her body. So she's naturally supposed to um, be this color. But, it, you know, I am an older person, so I have a little bit more of tan to my skin. But as you see with her, she looks like she, she was caramelized looking um, before, and, you know, maybe it's just the pictures. Mm, I don't know. But this is how she looks. I'm going to remove her pacifier because um, I know in the other video, y'all did not really get to see her. Um... Yeah, me and my fiance are going out later, so I'm going to, of course, I'm bringing her with. But I'm really going to show you. And she has a nice size mouth where I don't have to use no oils in her mouth. Um, and I don't have to really open her mouth, stress her mouth out with her pacifiers. And plus, Faith, I bought all preemie passies, small nipples. But let me see if I can somewhat get out of the light and show you. I hope y'all can see that. Hold on. Because her legs and arms is just moving. And I'm trying to get close where y'all can. I would like to show y'all. Okay, there you go. That is literally her gum. Her tongue, if you see, is right there. And then if I pull her lip up, if you look. Wait, where's that gum that my cousin was showing me? Oh, it's probably going to be hard for y'all to see, but it's back there. So, yeah, and she got her little little kneecaps. Like, she's just so, oh, man, you guys, this, this is like, a, seriously, she feels like a newborn baby. She really feels like a newborn baby. Like, I don't even know if I want her in her car seat because of the fact I just, I want to hold her so often. So we're going to try her drinking wet. So I'm just test it out because I'd like to know right away if there's an issue with that. Because some, some um, artists will test the drinking drinking wet system out and then some of them won't yeah she got her mouth is cut wide open so she naturally if you would want the bottle to be moving in and out which i don't you would naturally need a nipple a bigger a wider nipple so that she could pull properly but i already know the trick to that one <laughs> the trick to that is putting the, the water or milk, whatever you want to feed your, your um, drinking wet, you put it in the microwave and steam warm it. And when you do that, the pressure from, you know, tubing and piping or whatever in her, it will automatically pull that hot water. And it'll literally look as if, you know, her mouth, of course, ain't gonna be moving, but it's gonna look as if she's drinking because you ain't gotta move the bottle. You gotta be moving it in and out or squeezing it. As soon as you put it in her mouth, just squeeze it one time and it'll, that heat and gravity, I don't know what it is, but it pulls it. I noticed it, I learned that when I was feeding Malachi, Ezekiel, and I also noticed that it happens with um, Faith as well. So, I haven't had a chance to try it on her yet. Of course, she has more of a, um, you know, bigger mouth, so. I will see how that works, but I, I almost definitely like the fact that um, she sculpted like a little girl down here. Um, everything is so cute. Her little bum bum, it's got rosy cheeks on it. It's just so cute. Um, Faith, they literally just smoothed her out like a Barbie down and put a hole down there for her drinking wet. I wasn't happy about that on the price that I spent on her. 
I thought that was very lazy to do that. But with her, her little area down there is like it should be. So I was very, very pleased on that, that there's literally nothing that I really do not like about this. I'm very, very happy and content with how she came out. Most of the time, all my babies, you know, I like them. I really, really like them. But when I take them outside and the sun hit them and I really see what they look like, then I'd be like, dang. <laughs> you know, I felt like that with, with Faith. When Faith came home, I was like, oh my gosh, she's so pretty. As soon as I took her outside and that's when I could see, like, the silicone didn't look smooth. It looked blotchy, like, you know, no. I don't know if I just be overthinking it. You know, I know they handmade. But there are some silicones I done seen that, you know, look like that. And then I didn't even notice it in the picture. So I'm trying to get this. I'm going to have to get her brush out and sweep her face because her hair is extremely long. Like, I'm not going to do it now because I just brushed her hair down. But... Her hair is long, it is very long. She spiked it for me in one of her pictures she sent of her right before it was time for her to come home. And yeah. Now this ain't nothing but vinegar and water. I have not fed her formula yet. Um, see, the bottle just come right on out. She do got very soft silicone, so you gotta be, I, I feel like the softer the silicone, the, the easier that it can tear. So. Okay. Uh, don't mind all the baby clothes on the floor right there. I gotta re-go through uh, Faith and Rogue's clothes because that's all they preemie clothes. Winter is over here on a bumpy. Um, Jeremiah is on, winter is behind y'all, um, on a bumpy, and Jeremiah in his Nike suit, my big boy, he's sitting in a, in a swing set, well, in a bouncy, I mean, Faith is in her munchkin swing set, and Malachi is in my chest, I believe, and Genesis, remember her arm ripped in here? inside so I put her in a box I wrapped her up and put her in a box and Harmony is in my chest as well so those those are all my babies my fiance um, the last baby that was supposed to be home was um, was um, was Harmony in her and Rogue, and then we end up, I end up wanting to buy Winter, and I asked my fiance, you know, I just wanted another baby, a bigger baby, because all my babies are pretty much newborn size, and he said, I, you know, we sat on a, on a price range or whatever, and that's how Winter came home. Okay, I'm trying not to pit, pinch her skin. She had all these extra little hair fibers from being packed up. And her hair is really long and thick. So I'm just trying to get most of the, the little pieces of hair off her face. But she sure had a lot of it when I... Uh, okay, there we go. She should be okay. Because uh, I, I believe this hair is, yeah, she should be okay. Here we go. That's the only thing about silicones with hair is that it be everywhere. So if you thinking about getting a silicone and you don't like hair, <laughs> you, you know, make sure you don't have your baby rooted. 
because yeah there is no way for it to stay in the head it just gets everywhere so yeah she's very 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 tiny and i literally don't even want to sit her down nowhere i just want to hold her so this is silicone's silicone and reborn love life oh wait 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 y'all i'm so sorry i'm so I am like over ecstatic about this little girl that I didn't even check to see if her drinking wet actually worked. Yeah, see all I gotta do is pick her lip up and put her pacifier in. Nothing rubs against her lips. Cause her mouth's so big. Yep, her drinking wet worked. She did potty. Well, as you all know, as a disclaimer, we do not show parts on YouTube. So I will do that off camera. But this is Silicone and Reborn Love Life. Just wanted to share Rogue again since, you know, the box opening was in the car. Um, I will do a detailed video later, but I really just want to hold her. I haven't really even took pictures of her yet. So, um, yeah. Silicone and Reborn Love Life. Signing out.